and girls, this is your music teacher, Mrs. Huber. I'm here with my two cats. This one is Oscar, and this one is Louie. We're going to say goodbye to Oscar, and I'll sing a song with Louie, and today our song happens to be about cats. Bye, Oscar. The song I'm going to sing you today is called Naughty Tabby Cat. It goes like this. Naughty Tabby Cat, meow, you are very fat, meow, you have butter on your whiskers, Naughty Tabby Cat. A naughty tabby cat is somebody that was not doing what he's supposed to. So let's listen again this time and you tell me what is the cat doing that's so naughty? What's wrong with what he's doing? Naughty tabby cat, meow, you are very fat, meow, you have butter on your whiskers, naughty tabby cat, scat. Know what he's doing? That's right, he has butter on his whiskers. And if he has butter on his whiskers, that means his nose has been in the butter dish. Uh-oh. I don't know about you, but I don't leave my butter on the floor. So if he's got his whiskers covered in butter, it probably means he's been in the counter or in the kitchen where he's not supposed to be jumping up and eating that butter. So at the end of the song, we say scat. That means shoo, go away. So if we sing this song about our naughty tabby cat, um, we're trying to get him to go away from the butter dish, get out of the butter. Thanks, Louie, for singing the song with me today. I'm going to keep teaching to these first graders. I'll talk to you again more soon. Mwah. The song Naughty Tabby Cat uses a ta rest, which we learned last week. A ta rest is a beat with no sound, boys and girls. So when I sing the song again, I want you to find where I am not clapping. I'm going to clap on all the song words that are sounds. And when I clap, when I don't clap on a word, I want you to figure out where the rest is. That's the beat with no sound. I'll sing it again. Naughty tabby cat, meow, you are very fat, meow, you have butter on your whiskers, naughty tabby cat, scat. Did you find my words with no sound? That's right. Meow is a rest song. I did not clap on that word. And scat is a rest sound. I did not clap on that word. The other words in my song are either tas or tadis. A ta is one sound. The word cat is one sound. So that would be a ta. And if I say the word naughty, that's two sounds. So that would be a tadi. This time I'm going to clap the tas and tadis and I'm going to Shh, on the rest. Let's see if I can sing the song again, changing it to Taz and Toddies this time. Na, I'm gonna sing Toddy, Toddy, Ta, Meow, Toddy, Toddy, Ta, Meow, Toddy, 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 Ta, Meow. Let's say it without singing it. Let's say the Taz and Toddies that happen in our song. Toddy, Toddy, Ta, Shh. Toddy, toddy, ta, shh. Toddy, 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 ta, shh. Awesome. I'm so glad that you were able to do that song with me today and you got to meet my two cats. I want you to go to our Google form and I need you to look at the song page that has our ta's and toddies and it also has some ta rests on it. Would you do me a favor and will you clap and say the ta's and tadis? Make sure you do the rest with your hands apart. Um, say the song um, and I want you to clap and um, do the ta rest with hands apart. Practice the song for me and answer those questions at the bottom. And I look forward to doing some more music with you next week. Bye bye.